The top 10 end user features of Boomla. Let's go full screen. Number 1. Text editing. Open the Edit tab on the Boomla toolbar and change any text elements. Once you are done, hit Save. Number 2. Creating elements. Open the new tab and drag elements onto the page. Let's create a heading, a text block, and a new page. Number 3. Uploading files. Let's create a new gallery and upload images into it via drag and drop. The images are automatically resized for you. Number 4. Moving and sorting. Hovering your mouse over an image, a little circle called an icon appears. Grab it to sort the images. You can also sort contents that way. Or pages. Number 5. Undo, redo. Don't be shy to try things. You can undo anything. Number 6. Cut, copy, paste. Let's copy that gallery to that empty page. Let's copy that page and paste it as a subpage. Number 7. Customization. Let's change the maximum number of images in a row from 3 to 5. Let's change the image proportions. Number 8. Installing apps. I want to embed a gallery in a text, but I don't have such a layout in the toolbar. Let's install it from the Boomla store. This is it. You see in its documentation, it is indeed a floated layout tab. Let's install it. Select the website. Done. Refresh. Here it is. Add some text. Add the gallery. And upload some images. Note that Boomla is a platform and anyone can write applications for it. Number 9. Themes. Much like apps, themes are created on top of the Boomla platform. We offer one theme at the moment, more coming soon. If you want a custom theme, you can find someone to implement it for you. You can also change your mind anytime and easily migrate between themes. Number 10. Version control. Let's draw this time. You can create snapshots of your website. You can also create new branches on subdomains. That way, you can try things without your visitors noticing. This video was super dense, but don't worry, you'll find more in-depth tutorials inside. Sign up to get started.